Whatever it is, it better already be under control. Then double up the restraints this time if he's going to cause more trouble. Call for backup if you need more manpower, but he needs to stay awake. Let me ask you this. How much information do you think we'll be getting out of a man who's out cold for most of the day? Exactly. Find another way to keep him in check. Bring the girl. Do whatever you need to do. Break him. Keep me posted. Oh. <sighs> so sorry, dear. I didn't mean to let the food go cold. Bad news always spoils the taste. I'd rather get work over and done with, so I can put it all behind me when I need to relax. But there shouldn't be any more disturbances tonight. If there are, I'll leave it for after dinner. I must respect your time, as you have mine. Well, of course. I'll get to it right away. Oh, I've been looking forward to this all day. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did you change the recipe from last time? I seem to distinctly remember telling you how much I prefer the taste of parsley with meat and a touch of rock salt for texture. And they are especially pronounced in today's dish. Incredible work. I'd love for you to keep making it just like this. Yes, for every meal that you make. You aren't feeding anyone else whose opinion matters. The subordinates will learn to like it if they haven't already. Once they start calling the shots, then they can make a decision on how their food is made. Oh, please do not concern yourself with making modifications based on their personal preferences. If it doesn't kill them, then they should be perfectly fine. I simply would rather you not waste your time on something so trivial and tedious. If I wanted to make your job more difficult for you, I would have given you the task of preparing meals for the most recent additions to the dungeon. I've spared you from filling plates with scraps meant for dogs. But regardless, I think it's time for a change. You work so hard from when it's still dark out to the dead of night. I don't think you've set foot out in the sun since you came into my service. So, remove the extra steps and retire early for the day. Suppose I'll simplify it further, then. I'll relieve you of your duties of feeding my subordinates. Preparing their meals is a task that can fall to anyone. There is no replacing you when it comes to mine. Your job from now on will be to serve only me. No change in your salary. The payment is worth what you provide. And I'd like for you to start using that money to treat yourself more often. You should have the time for it now that I'm freeing up your schedule. <laughs> you may have prepared dinner for me, but your duties have not been completed for the day. Please, stay while I enjoy the rest. Would you like to have a seat? You can have mine if you'd like. All the time that I spend sitting at my desk probably isn't good for my back. And you're up on your feet all day as it is. Give them a rest. I suppose hunching over my food isn't good for me either. <laughs> Then I wouldn't mind sharing, if that's your concern. 
Of course. Come, sit here. Yes, on my lap. I promise not to make it too uncomfortable. Let me know if it gets a little too claustrophobic, and I can arrange for something better. Otherwise, I wouldn't mind the extra company. Please, have a seat then. That's not too harsh, is it? I apologize if it's not as soft as you prefer. My legs have always been a bit stiff. Gums with the territory of my line of work. Feel free to get up at any point if you need to. Do not suffer in silence for my sake. Oh, I am perfectly fine like this. Personally, I enjoy this arrangement. But, no worries. I'll finish up quickly. Mm. My, my. Wonderful until the very end. You have my gratitude, as always. I bet you are ready to take a nice, long, and well-deserved nap. It's so unfocused. A bit of rest should help brighten up that face. I'd like to see those eyes of yours light up. Is something the matter? If I'm speaking out of line, please do let me know. I'm not above everything, I'll admit. I've done a few things that would warrant a reprimand if I had someone overseeing me. But that is why I must ask you instead. Feel free to tell me if I've done something to bother you. You have permission to, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> is that what this is about? And if I have frightened you, I apologize. Please understand that my harsh treatment of enemies does not coincide with my treatment of staff. Or you, for that matter. You will not be punished if you refuse me. Not for your work. I mean my advances. <laughs> I thought I made it very clear with all of this, but perhaps I should be more upfront in my approach. Would it be alright if I touched your face? <laughs> Forgive me if my hand feels rough. I'm not as lucky to have such delicate skin. I envy how soft yours is. Ah. Uh, might I be allowed to go further? That is not part of your duties. Just a request. I won't take nothing for an answer. It's yes or no. Well? Very good. Mm -hmm. Not too much, is it? Or not enough? Maybe. Let's see how much you like it, then. Mm. 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 I can tell you for sure that I like it. <laughs> One more and I'll let you go for today. Mm. Now go on. You have the rest of the day to enjoy yourself. I still have work to do. I expect calls at any given moment. Our most recent addition to the dungeon seems to be causing more trouble than he's worth. If something goes awry again, I need to be ready to act at a moment's notice. On top of that, I still need to prepare a replacement for your old position. That's just how it is, unfortunately. This position has you on your feet at all hours of the day. And I'm sure that's something you can relate to. Well, hopefully not anymore. I expect you to be much more vibrant and stress-free from now on. 
In fact, I hope to check up on you later tonight to make sure that you are doing exactly what I asked you to do. Think of them as your after-hour duties that require an after-hours assessment from me. The only difference here is that it's making sure you aren't working when you aren't supposed to. I'd see it less as work for me, and more so something that puts me at ease, knowing that I'll have someone with a lot more energy there to give some back to me. <laughs> In ways you don't need to think about too much, dear. So I better see you enjoying yourself later tonight. Otherwise, I will personally make sure of it myself. <laughs> Hello everyone, it's Prince Carver. Thank you all so much for listening to another one of my audios. Before you click off, be sure that you leave a comment with the word dear somewhere in there. Spell it however you wish, and I'll be sure to give you a heart. Thank you so, so much for all of your support. It truly does mean the world to me. Special thank you goes out to all my patrons, especially that of my precious pets. Creek, Lunar, Venowin, Toka, T. Briscoe, Michelle, Nikki Paley, and an adventurer. If you're interested in getting audios earlier, perhaps not safe for work extras, be sure to check out my Patreon. It'll be in the link tree in the pinned comment down below. Thank you all so, so much for all that you do for me. Excuse the truck that's definitely pulling by my house. I have been Prince Cairo, and remember that your prince loves you all. Mwah.